unfortunately it's, uh, it's happened to us a few times at Richmond here, so, you know, lead the whole race and then some stupid, some dumbass move brings out a caution with, you know, coming to the white flag and, um, and re ruins our whole night, so it is unfortunate, but, uh, you know, honestly, just an awesome job by my team, and, um, you know, Auto Owners Camry was the rocket, it was, uh, you know, something we like we've had here in the past, and, um, you know, unfortunately this has happened to us a few times, so. Come in with the lead, go out second, you know, to the fastest pit crew on pit road is, uh, it's a tough one to swallow, but I feel like, you know, we, we still could have had a race for it, but um, just got used up in turn one on the restart. What can you make of the contact with the five, and then, of course, uh, the, the bumps to Hamlin there for this race? Yeah, I mean, I just, I felt like 11 used me up down here in turn one, and, um, you know, so I, was, I didn't really appreciate, you know, a teammate racing me like that. I, I wish you would have, uh, you know, gave me a chance, um, but yeah, that's the way it is. And then, um, yeah, the five just, uh, he bumped me in the, you know, drove in the side of me in one and two, and I got a little loose um, down the back stretch. I don't know if my left rear was going down or what, and I kind of slammed into him. No big deal. What do you think of the quality of racing science stage two and stage three after you kind of went to the normal track conditions? Uh, it was typical Richmond, you know, it's, um, tires go off and then it gets really really hard to pass and you get traffic and it it really hurts your tires a lot but you know that's just kind of what we fought here in the past pretty typical Richmond